I'm Jason Dale, and this is Two Minutes in the Hills. As the nation prepares to celebrate our freedom, Rochester Hills got to celebrate one of the heroes that made that possible. In a special ceremony inside City Hall, Rochester Hills resident and Vietnam War veteran Edward Henderson was awarded six service medals. The ceremony was hosted by Rochester Hills resident and U.S. Congressman Mike Bishop. After spending my entire life here in Rochester Hills, I can tell you um, our community, this community, is very tight-knit. But it's really moments like this that brings our community together even more. And uh, I, uh, I'm really proud to be here today, and I'll probably say that several times before this is all over with. Um, Edward has called this community, uh, he and his wife, Martha, have called this community uh, home for 25 years. As the uh, proud congressman of the, of the 8th District, he contacted our office. Uh, he just wanted to get his service records. That's all he was looking for. But in the process, the U.S. Army identified uh, several things, uh, not the least of which is to mention to us that he had earned not one, but six awards and medals and had never received them. Congressman Bishop was joined by Rochester Hills resident and Brigadier General David Bassett. When we deploy some of our soldiers, we deploy them to places where later they're not even allowed to tell you where they were. And sometimes it takes many decades to pass before they can come around and admit where they were at. And so when Edward was in Thailand and he came back, it wasn't something he was allowed to talk about because his mission in Thailand, I'm going to go ahead and blow it now since it's been so many years. <laughs> Um, he served with the, uh, the Army Security Agency. And the Army Security Agency was a predecessor to other agencies, such as the National Security Agency, which, uh, whose mission it is is to provide intelligence on the things that are going on in our adversaries. And so while Mr. Henderson was in Thailand, he was helping to gather the intelligence that helped keep all of our soldiers in, in Vietnam to help make them safer and more effective in their missions. And so he couldn't talk about it. And as sometimes does happen, uh, as things are classified, things get overlooked. And today we're trying to right that wrong for Mr. Henderson and his family. The proclamation from Mayor Barnett stated, Mr. Henderson went above and beyond for our nation in Thailand and Vietnam and placed our nation's security above his own. He displayed courage and devotion to our nation and represents American character at its best. I think it's safe to say Mayor Barnett speaks for all of us. So, as you enjoy your 4th of July celebrations and the freedoms we all have as Americans, remember to thank a veteran.